Dave, two good performances and results. Confidence must be high for Trinity. Yeah, uh, confidence is high in the camp. Um, obviously, you know, these are the kind of games that you uh, really look forward to. Um, did well against Salford last year at home. And hopefully we can uh, replicate that kind of performance. Uh, more importantly, you know, try and build on the confidence shown in the uh, last two And after three tricky away games, it must be nice to be back at the North End. My home form's not great, but um, you know, it's, it's, it's something that we want to try and improve. Um, my performance on the road has been really good, so um, yeah, well, it's about time we started to match them performances at home and hopefully get some of the crowd at uh, home to, to chat about. And you've brought in three new defensive players this week. What, yeah. What's the thinking of bringing them in? I just feel the squad needed freshening up. Um, obviously, there's people that have come into the football club who've, who've not really lived up to the expectations, in my opinion. Um, you know, and so it's, you can't carry anybody in this football club. And um, if that sees that or sees certain things that are different, um, then it has to be changed. You know, we did it last year when we, when we came into the club, we made six changes and brought six in, and it, it gives a total different dimension. So hopefully today, um, you know, one or two can come into the squad uh, and show what how, how good footballers they are. And, Help the, other, help the rest of the players um, try and win football matches at home. You've got quite a few defenders on the books now. Is that is that nice to have that depth? We do a lot of defending, don't we? Um, in, in early season, our defensive um, performances weren't great, and that's not just the back four, but it collectively wasn't wasn't brilliant. And we've changed the way we have played the last couple of games, and it's really worked for us. Um, so we need them options. Um, Kearns Cup tied, so obviously that's one that's came out the side for spending more. Even though I didn't think we missed him as much as I thought we would. Um, you know, the lads that came in did really well. So we, we just need options. Uh, the good thing about having these uh, young lads um, into the squad is from Derby and Notts County, um, you know, they're, they're, they're there for experience. So it's not about the money, it's about them getting experience and, and we get good players at the same time. It allows us to freshen it up in other areas. Um, and that, that's just the way you have to be as a football club. Salford, one of the, the bigger teams in this division. Do you feel that your style of play is better suited against the better teams? I think the results have proven that. Um, even though that, you know, when it was expansive early season, you know, when you score four and against the top of the league team, um, Darlington three. So, you know, we know we've got goals in the team. It's just maybe we have to think of that a little bit more defensively and try to, to keep clean sheets first and foremost. If you keep clean sheets, that builds confidence and allows you to come and play forward um, a lot more, bra- a little bit braver. And we just got to stay in games. That's how we've looked at it when we addressed it after the um, Alfin disaster. You know, we had to basically strip it back, look at how, how we've done in certain games and we just felt that the way to go from York onwards was the way we played. So no need to change that. You know, we won one and draw one out of the last two and uh, hopefully we can continue that today. And a big crowd expected today. Does that give you players a boost? Oh, there's nothing better than, than playing in front of big crowds. Um, like I said, we've already been to Stockport in front of three and a half. We've had York two and a half, Darlington nearly two. So, uh, you know, the lads raise the games when there's a lot of people watching and you've got a lot of pride at stake. So. Um, hopefully we can change our home form today and, and to do it in front of a big crowd would be even better. Okay, thank you. Cheers guys, thank you. Thank you.